Good morning peeps, James Atkins Fishing here. I'm at Rentham Field Farm Fisheries and this is the, what they used to call the Three Islands Lake but they took the islands out. I'll show you where I'm fishing today. Let's have a look. This is peg four, you can see it down there, just through the net. I fed the swim out there and plumbed it. That's where I had some good fish over there and peg just over here. And over there is where I had that big old white koi cup over in what they call the hedge pond because there's a big hedge down beside it. Right, let's get out there. There's been fish jumping around all over the place. And I'll get back to you in a minute, see where we're getting on. Well, first put out, look. Lovely roach on a bread punch, eight mil bread punch. Good start. <laughs> We're in again, and that's a big old goldfish. <laughs> I knew I'd catch some here today. The size of that. <laughs> Oops, come out of the net. There we go, look, look. keep still. <laughs> big old fat goldfish, how fat is that, look? <laughs> Brilliant, great fun. Different colour every time, innit? <laughs> Andy May would love this. Look at that, another one, look. Right in the top lip. <laughs> Great fun to catch them. <laughs> I don't show you the fikes. <laughs> Too much film going on here. Top lip again. Different colour every time, isn't it? <laughs> How fat they are, look. <laughs> Lovely little fish. <coughs> Another big old fat goldfish. Well, a white goldfish. So they're goldfish anyway, were they? White or red. How fat he is, look. <laughs> in again. <laughs> Another big old fat white goldfish. Don't know why they're called goldfish when they're white. <laughs> it don't matter, it's good fun. Oh now you fight. Come here. Hook has gone through his lip and gone caught in the net. That's got it. That's a good pound, ain't look at that, look. Oh. I think the lady said they must be spawning because they look as though they're full of eggs. <laughs> That's a proper goldfish. That's a proper goldfish. Right in the top lip again. See, that's proper gold, look. <laughs> Get him in the sun, look at that. <laughs> right, peeps, I better show you how I'm fishing it. Um, I've got the 10 to 12 elastic, which is quite light because there's nothing massive in here. And as you can see, I've got a size 16 on there. And it's coming to two number eights there, two number eights there. And I'm just having a play with a funny little float here, it's a dibber. As you can see, it's a dibber. 4 by 12 Preston's innovation. As you can see, the line goes straight through the middle of it. That's so you can catch big old carp and that won't snap your float. Because that can go right through it and that won't do any harm. That come out there, look, it's it just come through there. Right, so that's how I'm catching all these big old goldfish at the minute. Let's have a bit more fun and catch some more, hopefully. And all I'm doing is, get that bread punch. Nice thick white bread. Warburton's is the best for this, I was told. I can't get the toasties at the minute, so this is just thick white. Just one eight mil punch, hook it through to size 16. Just like that. 
let's get out there. <laughs> Lovely day today, the sun's now out, it's pouring down rain when I got here, I thought yeah that's typical for me, I'm fishing on a Tuesday and it poured down with rain but it's stopped now and the sun's out and there's a little tiny breeze got up, so I can show you where I'm fishing, only what, five sections on today so I'm not very far out, I'll say it's six metres, seven metres, change from fishing in gales and stuff like I have been <laughs> pouring down the rain but it's gone nice blue sky I put a little little pot of just a half a pot of hemp seed and a couple of pinches of micros which I had left over from last week <coughs> I've had what six or seven fish now go little touches they just double about a bit float just did 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 perhaps I should have a finer tip on and dot it down finer I don't know but these goldfish tend to mess around a little bit so you just wait for a good old tug and you got them don't know if you can see the bubbles out there where I fed it, just there. It's like a cauldron. <laughs> Noisy old rooks up there. It's obviously not crows, because crows don't live in a rookery, do they? <laughs> I missed out, I do not know. Here we come again. As you can see, big old fat goldfish. Look at them. <laughs> Proper handful, as you can see. <laughs> Fantail, look, look at that. How big that fantail is, look. <laughs> As you can see, there ain't much on the bait table. It's just a few micros I froze from last week. Little bits of bread and the bread punch. Hemp seed. That's all I got. Here we are, another goldfish hook. Quite such a big one this time. Don't matter. Little tiny one. Whoops, stop dropping my pole away. Right in the top lip. Where does it get a hold of it? Oh, it's going in at a funny angle. Come here. Need to discord you. Open your mouth, mate. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm making a right fiddly of this, aren't I? Here we are. <laughs> you got one, aren't we? <laughs> Here we are again. <laughs> Bigger goldfish this time. It's a big one. That goldfish. Crikey. <laughs> oh, <they're all> <laughs> this one's even fatter still. <laughs> the size of it, look. 
<laughs> Another goldfish shot. <laughs> oh, that's all there is in my swim at the minute. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> ah, we're in with the first carp of the day. Got him. Only a little common carp. It's okay on light tag or. <laughs> Oh, hook just come out in the net, lovely. Get it out of the way. Now he's going to fight. There we go, look. Look how shiny he is. Lovely little common carp. <laughs> We've got a fan tail. A skimmer, a little skimmer. There we are, and another one. Look, hooks come out in the net. <laughs> Put his fins up for us. Look, get your fin back up, mate. There we go. Look. Another. That's just absolutely stuffed full of these goldfish in here. As you can see, I caught dozens today. It's even fatter still, look. <laughs> and another big old fatty. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. It's a fan dial, this one, look. And I've got big old hands that make him look smaller. That's a good pound and a half. <laughs> Absolutely loads today. <laughs> That's a deep red one, that one. Or orange. I don't know why they call them goldfish, because they're red, aren't they? <laughs> As you can see, it's a campsite. You've got showers and toilets. Showers there, and women's loos there. Caravan park. Obviously for caravans as well. So it's not far to come to have a leak. And I'll show you the way back so I can show you it's not very far to walk to use the loos. As you can see there's one pond over there, another pond there and one over there and you can see where I'm fishing there and there's another one over there. So it's only what well, 50 yards to go it's not far to walk for a leak I've said before on these videos you got dipping tanks for your nets just to be on the careful side. 
adjustment that didn't take long in many paces. And there's my office for the day. Peg four, I said earlier, I think. Here we are. I'll give it a little bit longer. Catch you later. We have another white a goldfish <laughs> or a fanta, whichever you like to call them. Come on around your fins. That's all wrapped up, look. <laughs> Ooh, careful, careful, careful. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Ah, I've got a ghosty. <laughs> I just I don't know them. I will get that without the disgorger, I think. No, I can't. Lovely jubbly. Come on, get off. When I was bringing that one in, I see at least a two foot long carp that just scared out of there. There we go, look. Lovely little ghosty to finish with. <laughs> just give me a thumbs up down the bottom there. And subscribe if you like. I've got loads of videos for you to watch. This is Field farm fisheries with all those lovely goldfish, ghosties, big carp in here. I just see one. <laughs> I'll catch you again later. Cheers. Bye bye for now.